Welcome to our space. Thank you so much for being here. Lots of you have supported the museum and I want to thank you for that. But even more, thank you for your incredibly generous role at the University of Kansas. It's got to be one of those places that's so special for students and of course alumni. We have two exhibitions coming up this summer uh, here at the Spencer Museum. And still we rise, race, culture, and visual conversations and narratives of the soul. One is a touring exhibition, the first one. And the other is one that we are going to organize. It's a natural for us to show work from our collection and we are very fortunate to have some of the most important quilters in this area and on a national scale uh, whose work is represented in our collection. The African American narrative is extremely important to the arts in that it allows artists of African descent to share their stories, not only visually, but through the literary and performance process as well. Art is extremely important. And the more we delve into it, the more you learn about one another. Everything that I'm sharing with you today about East Side is very real, it's very true. The end of the story is that it's about community. East Side is the neighborhood and the area that I grew up in in Joplin, Missouri. The east side of Joplin is buzzing. Folks getting ready to go to Eward Park for the 4th of August celebration. That was the day, the day of the Emancipation Proclamation. Deep under a quilt blanket, as the morning chill wears off with a quickness, my sister Cheryl, she and I were half up all night long giggling. My mother had just finished pressing and curling Miss Ethel's hair, the last customer for the day. She would get up very early in the morning and my father would say, so you have another head to do, huh? She said, yes, I'm gonna burn some curls. <laughs> the yellow that you see in the pieces are sunshine, red, is a depiction of how these women dressed. The black configuration are the, the streetways and, and the alleyways. For one person to create something for another person is beyond a gift. That's what art is. And when you have the ability to share that gift with another human being, you are opening a door that will never close. And what's important about being here today is that you're showing support for an institution that has served the test of time, educationally, intellectually, and they've done it through the arts as well. So what you have today from me is my heart and my hand handing it to you. Thank you for allowing me to share my story.